And now entering the snack pit, which is one of my favorite levels, if not my most favorite level, because of A, the creatures that are be inside of it, but also B, seem that's gonna go with the biggest one. And the creatures also make it kind of the saddest. You can see one in the corner right there, but you hear it in a second. We got ourselves red bugs. Mostly the giant red bug, which has a <laughs> very silly theme to it. And I like how of all the bosses, this is one that is apparently special enough to get its own theme. So you got a water base that does, and a titan dweeble that does. I don't think any of the other um, bosses in this game actually give us a theme. Let's see if we could tug a work this out. Oof. Thankfully we can, but it looks like we couldn't, so I would rather make sure I'll pick the survive because like I didn't realize until watching I think the backlogs video or press A's video that all you need in order to get a perfect score is to just have all your pigments survive. I always thought that you actually needed to get the the cor- well, not the corpses, I know that you didn't need corpses, but I always thought that you needed the, uh, all the treasures too, not just the key and to survive. Okay, big red bug, please grab this one, okay, thank you. Not that I don't want the, the smaller one to, uh, to get it, it's just, it's gonna be quicker this way, because the giant red bug has the key, so we're focusing on getting that guy first. But on the plus side, having these guys here means we could just start squishing them. So we could actually get the other bread bugs to go here. But also so we could just get the um, giant bread bug closer to actually no, <laughs> getting through. Okay, there we go. So you'd be like, perfect. Like lining up. Plus now we could get all the other treasures and all the corpses and stuff like that too. Of course, we gotta get this smaller guy first too. Because... <laughs> Even though we could just continue as is, we probably get to go for the further ones, which honestly I'm not gonna complain about. Because that means we could just grab these and grab all the other treasure as they're like right there. So it just kind of lines up perfectly. And of course, get these guys to get the key so we can actually continue. Let's see, where's this little guy trying to go here? It'd be across from us because I think this is one of the very few ones that are actually going to be the same no matter what in terms of where the placement's gonna be for, for, for the entrance and exit. I thought that dude just came back to life. I was gonna be like, whoa, okay, that's a magical dude. <laughs> so close. And we have already done it this row, but for some reason, the recording for it just disappeared, and I had like one bit of it, but not the other bits. We're just gonna kind of quickly redo these. I'm very curious to know if I can actually go to beat this. It feels like, in comparison, this went a whole lot quicker than it before. But also for the next one, it's a little bit more uh, tough of a challenge. That's just because of the creature that's gonna be inside of it, or the creatures rather. The very chaotic one. Okay, so who's going to win? These guys or those guys? Oh, it's more of a tie. Okay, well, we will take that. And all of us back in the loot. Wait, where are you Louis the whole time? I don't know. <laughs> it doesn't matter though, because we got it through, and now let's see if we beat our high score. Wow, well, we we're all for like 10 seconds for the last one. And let's see here. We, we kind of did. So I think our if you have a second, I think the first score was the one that we originally did. I'm not too sure. But we are now shimmying into the three color training, which is one of the more awkward challenges, not necessarily a hard one. That's just because of the tower being a hint. <laughs> but also the electricity down here. We got ourselves a gatling gun. So we're gonna try to get this poison out of the way. And I think this is one of the good times I'm actually going to have all of our be bait. It's because it's gonna be a lot better. Can you see, is there treasure here? There is treasure, okay. So, uh... I guess Louis is gonna be... <laughs> be I think he should be safe right there. Okay, cool. Looks like he is safe, which is perfect. And the rest of them are just gonna kind of chill over here, I guess. 
never would get a... Okay, yeah, he is finally there, right? That is hilarious. But of course the purple Pikmin is decided to like, stop like, right there. <laughs> and now we have two sprays. We're gonna start using them now and hopefully won't... Uh, Okay, good this we needed to get a little bit closer. Hi Gabbling Boy, yeah we are here now. Ah I see, we just decided to come it right here. That big man was very fiery. That would have been very sad. And okay. <laughs> Louis man, why did he have to go right towards this again? I mean whatever works works. But still doesn't mean it's not <laughs> more or less awkward. <laughs> oh buddy, come here! And bingo! <laughs> Thank you so much, Yellow Pikmin, for being such MVPs. I gotta appreciate the ones that are just kind of staying there. And now we can grab the rest of the Pikmin here, because we don't need to worry about playing uh, Tagurit with <laughs> these guys here. Darn it, I was hoping that the, uh... Oh, there's some tights right here. Time the tights. Gonna have to squish you with these guys, okay? Thank you. Oh, you didn't even give me any nectar. Oh, you did get nectar. Okay. Good. I'm glad you did. I would be kind of unfortunate if you didn't. Okay, so now we're just gonna try to get as much Pikmin to have nectar as possible. That is beautiful right there. Beautiful. Now, get the yellow Pikmin to take care of these guys because terrifying when you. No, actually. All these guys are right in the center here. We could just do this. Normally I wouldn't do that, but I think it would be a pretty decent idea. A pretty decent, 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 decent time to do so. So they're all clustered together anyways, I may as well. And BAM! That makes it so much quicker. There is also more um, hidden treasures around here. So I'm gonna leave Louie here. Okay. Well, Louie, you do your best to be by yourself right there. I knew it. There's still some flower pigment here. A little bit of nectar doesn't hurt. It really doesn't hurt, especially when you want to get most of your pigment to have flowers on that there. Kids. I, I don't know if Louie just dropped there. It feels like he just kind of waved at us. But hi Louie, if you were waving at us. I was so hoping that we we're going to get some more spicy sprays here. <laughs> yes, I think there are still um Actually, oh, okay, they're doing their thing anyways. I think we still have one more white on us. Not maybe two? No, this one. That's unfortunate, but that's okay. We can get these guys to help out. Because all we really should need is that. And ideally, we keep these guys with us. And these guys aren't. Surprisingly, are not. Um, to, to try to electrify here. Like you would think they would. Nope. Then just in case, I don't think when they shard up like that, they're actually a threat. But I'd rather play it safe and make sure that's actually the case. And okay, now this guy is the last guy. So... Okay, I thought I just locked a Pikmin right into the poison. Thankfully we didn't. There's an egg right there too. Okay, so... A little bit left, and I'm uh, pretty sure we already checked in here as had treasure in it, did it not? Yes, okay. We will use this spray, and go around. <sighs> that ended up being our last treasure too, which is really funny. I thought there was going to be one around where the gathering court was, which I mean, I'm not complaining. But also, sorry if I sound a little bit stuffed up. I'm dealing with some allergies, but also still slightly recovering from a cold as well, and dang it, we didn't even beat our high score. But that's okay, because we'll just move on, and we did a pretty good score. <laughs> but now on to hazard training, <laughs> which is one of those levels which you would think you would have to split both Almar and Louie up, but, well, that's ideal, that is. <laughs> but you really don't need to worry about that, because there's enough hallways or alleyways, or whatever you want to call them, and pipes that you really don't need to worry about that. Yeah, I wonder if that's where the cave is going to be. I don't know, the only way to really find out is by actually going forward. Of course, right here is where you probably should split up. 
because oh there's fire and you know that every other pikmin has got a fire pikmin and <laughs> the fire does not go well also who else is kind of annoyed with the fact that um your pikmin are still going to be on fire even when they're going to the water like i noticed a video game and video game logic isn't always there but you would still think that like hey <laughs> Maybe this logic would make the best sense, but no, it doesn't. <laughs> so well, no, 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 you guys, come back here. I want the blue Pikmin to gather these. Is uh, well, they could just go into the water and get that super quickly for us. And there is some treasure right there. No problem, I think. Oh, hello, Dweevil. How are you guys doing? We have enough blues on us to actually get we do. Just barely enough. Dude, <laughs> hi, where are you going, Dweevil? We need to go into safety, and I know that. I don't... <sighs> wow, E. <laughs> you got that. Also, here's something I also didn't really realize. It's actually a thing. Uh, apparently, um, Dweevils could actually still do their defense when they have treasures on top of them. I actually just found that out from doing this challenge just on my own. I kind of just learned a lot about challenge mode just by kind of just doing it on my own. And okay, so there's a fiery bull box right there. Hi, buddy. Yeah, you're, you're, just, you're gonna get punched, okay? Because really, the pig didn't want to land the top of you, which is fine. I can see why. It still sucks. <laughs> nope. You guys are just stuck. What made you stuck in the water here? So just. Oh, it must have called. Oh, did a uh, dweevil? Of course, it's a dweevil. <laughs> oh, I love these little guys. No, no. You go get to the water, you fool. Come on now. Don't take out yourself. You have so much to live for. <laughs> oh, Pikmin. Okay, Blowhog, now it's time for you to be, uh, get defeated. <laughs> because I want to make sure that we're going to be safe with the fiery Blowhog. Of course, this is where I was thinking we're going to use a bitter spray. I was thinking maybe the spicy spray, but it might be quicker that way. Now we're going to get you out of the way too. And okay, here's where we're going to split our beautiful little Pikmin up. And Louie, you with me too. And bitter spray time. Can I use this spicy spray on the next floor? Because there's another enemy that's just a little bit more uh, terrifying than this guy. This guy's mostly just terrifying just because of, well, the fact it has fire on it. Neil, you guys with us, please, because we got this little dude down here as well as another treasure. Hopefully, we have enough to actually get both. We should be okay. Actually, no, we will be okay. We could just get that guy there. And all these guys on this one. Just barely enough. Oh my goodness. Now, you guys, water pigmen are gonna be a lot more quick with actually getting it through. Not that I don't want you guys to grab it. It's just, I want it to be a little bit more quick. That doll. <laughs> I don't, wow. Yeah, I expected that to kind of be in the hallway. I didn't expect it to be right there. So I'm pretty sure somewhere around here. No, we went through all of it. Sometimes there's an egg that appears here. You guys are going around here. It also feels like there should be something right in here. But th there isn't. I don't know why. I'm guessing it's because this area is a mimic. Quote unquote mimic. It's just, no, I don't know why I thought it's on fire all the across from there. I think it's because this is a map that's kind of based more off of the uh, uh, water base area. The submerged castle. <laughs> that's what it's called. And it's like, yeah, there it's, 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 it's should be something here as well. Like an egg or something. Because if there's an egg there, it could be a shot that we can get another bitch spray. But now on to the next floor. Which, fingers crossed, we are going to survive this next not so friendly friend. <laughs> Thankfully, I don't think it has as much health as other guys. I hear it snoring. You can see it across from there. Of course, it has some little dudes with it too. 
Let's not lock our, uh, our beds into the water, ideally. We're gonna take all our Pikmin with us here in hopes we can survive. You know what, maybe this will be the one time that we're actually going to punch. I'd rather, my goodness, of course that RNG right there. Yeah, the time you guys out to the corner over here or something. <laughs> That's the wise you might just like <laughs> end up getting yourselves into the water. Okay, now that those guys are cleared, I'm actually going to take a risk and see if we can actually get this guy uh, defeated all in one go. Oh shoot, where's that? Oh, okay, we, we're good. Just survived that. Terrifying, but thankfully we are okay. <laughs> Whew! It's just like, it's like that button in you, it's like this or this. It's like choosing about like, what you want to do. It's like, Use the spray or not use the spray. <laughs> or use the Pikmin or not use the Pikmin. <laughs> okay. Hopefully they'll go around the Geisha because sometimes they okay. good. The Geisha is just gonna be all of the way. But since we have the better spray so on us. Oh, I was gonna say we may as well get this. But that's fine. We got the key, that's all that matters. Now apparently let's just go until we run out of uh, ran out of time, although we should be fine. We should be able to get this out for real. Oh, well. Polymar, you're just gonna stay there, okay, buddy? Like, you do you. Whew, good job, little guys. Like, how are they all going towards that? Please, my goodness, blue pick them. Why are you trying to be heroes or trying to get Geisha out of the way? You know that it's gonna be difficult. Hard. You know it's gonna be dangerous for you guys, yet you still tried. I appreciate it, but still, Nelly. Well, that's a, a little bit close to comfort, but that's okay. <laughs> now, this ring here, this is the most awkward treasure here. Just because we're sitting. Like, why does it need to be so really awkward? And of course, most of the treasures now are just going to be in the water, but that's a no. Oh, but good. These red people are going to give me a heart attack, I swear. <laughs> it's like, this is why we can't have good things, red Pikmin. This is why we can't have good things. But I do appreciate... <laughs> I do appreciate all of your efforts, though. I could just... <laughs> Maybe I should just time them out. Where, uh... All are it. <laughs> That should be the last of it. Oh, it isn't. It's, oh, wait. Well, maybe. We might still be one kind of in that cage area. And yep, yeah, okay. Good to know. Is there one in here? I suppose I wonder. It feels like it would be. And there it is. Okay, cool. This is why I grab the majority of the blues to go here. Oh, come on now. Like, I thought I threw enough in there. Oh well, that's fine. Now they should be okay. Good. Now you guys need to get this. I'm sorry I dragged you guys right there though. Poor Louie. He's so low of health now. <laughs> like, oh, what a mode. What a mode. But this is why it's challenge mode though, not easy breezy. <laughs> Beautiful cover girl mode. Oh, I'm glad we went back here now. We grab this guy. And thankfully they won't all go into the water. And thankfully they also didn't just go towards the corpse to try to grab that. <gasps> and I'm also glad that the AI in this game makes it so that the blue pigment aren't just going to drag the reds or other colors into the water. That would be very sad, very unfortunate. But I don't think we're gonna beat our high score. It feels like we have it feels like we have less time here. That we did before. The only way to find out is by going through this glacier. <laughs> also, water check because uh, I have water next to me. I'm gonna drink some between here. 
Do you have to drink any water? I need hydration. I'll repeat the time and barely not higher score. But that's okay. <laughs> Two K of us snarls we go. <laughs> now it kinda of sounds like there would be snaggers in it because snarls and snaggers kinda of sound similar. Similar. <laughs> but there isn't. Magic had a surprise too, considering we fought at least four of them. But there is something equally as annoying but also a lot more cute that we have to deal with, which would be the puffy blow hogs right here. Okay, we got some of them, but thankfully oh okay, there are leaves going off of that. No, don't you eat our Pikmin. I don't think so. Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> oh good, is there more here that we have to worry about? There was, but thankfully there was enough Pikmin that kind of idolized here. <laughs> we didn't have to worry about it. And yes, that little guy did, in fact, have the key on it. <laughs> That's why I was going after it first and not really worrying about anything else. Now I'm kind of hoping that the cave's going to be like right beside us. Because that would be very funny if that was the case. And it looks like it is not. Ah, that's okay. Is that... There was a few times when I was doing challenge on my own that it ended up being like right, right there. We already got this case, sure. Okay, we did. No? I do put up our Pikmin so we can get this the big boy right here. Yes, I know, we have Pikmin. But you know what? We're not gonna allow you to hit our Pikmin though. I love it, what a sheer dogs just <laughs> follow our Pikmin into the water. It's like you would think to be smart enough not to do that. Considering how hazardous it is, but like, nope, it's there. Whoa, Gem, where are you going? At least I didn't bonk blew your arm on the head. Yeah, of course, they're going like right into the geisha, though. See, we think we would just go into the water, but no. <laughs> They'd rather just light themselves on fire for some reason. Hey, Chiro, are you hungry enough to go into the water here, or are you? Yeah, let's get us there. You gotta be one of the smart ones. No, you. You're just going to continue to follow us in there, anyways. <laughs> silly sheer cubs. Silly, silly sheer cubs. And just enough blues to be able to get all the treasure on this side. Gotta love it when it happens. Now, of course, we can give these guys some aids here. <laughs> Where did you come from, little sheer cub? <laughs> Oh, I love it. It's, it's ridiculous. You still don't get hit by the fire. Of course, you got hit by the fire right there. You can... Yeah, you should set up everywhere. I mean, I know that I should have, like, brought it out. Like, I didn't expect it to be, like, this much of an issue to us. <laughs> oh, oh, well. Oh, well. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> Okay, there we go. There's enough of like, an awkward gap between all of it. It's just, like, did we not get all the treasures? <laughs> like, we don't have any light, so there's no period treasures. <laughs> but now, going on to sub-level 2, which is why I kept the bitter spray. Because there's no safety nets here, and there is yet another blow hog here. Of course, this dude just like, turned around right there. Okay, perfect. Now we're gonna have to take care of you buddies. I do feel bad when we have to encase them in stone, but at the same time, I would rather allow our Pikmin to just survive and actually be able to breathe. Yeah, I was gonna go ahead and just get our uh, Pikmin again. No, I don't think so, buddy. But there are still, um, <laughs> said Tweefles. There's still these guys around here, cheer groups, that I would much rather kind of just escort our Pikmin make sure that they're actually safe. Now we can all go and gather their one little feather. I wonder where this is gonna be. I'm gonna just, like, guess it's gonna be over there. I would be surprised if it were. And it is! Pleasantly surprised it is right there. Okay, a meal, a little male shoe grub there. Rest in peace, buddy. You did your best to try to defeat our Pikmin. But at the end, you know what, that kind of just wrecked yourself. <laughs> Good job, little red Pikmin. I love how we could just leave the uh, Pikmin to themselves to just fight 
<laughs> quote unquote fight the geishers. <laughs> I also don't know if it's geisha or geisha or how you're supposed to actually say that word. I just realized I'm saying them kind of both ways. <laughs> how do you say it? Do you say geisha? Do you say geisha? Or are we just gonna grab and throw our purple Pikmin there? Because we know it's gonna be able to go up on its own, it's gonna be fine. And I see there's still some shoe cups here. Yeah, there is. Sorry, little little nuggets. Gotta fight ya. Let's not do that. I'm sorry, little pet Pikmin. And is this the last treasure that we needed? It was! Okay, cool. That could have got a whole lot worse, but thankfully we didn't fling any of our Pikmin off. <laughs> and get our Pikmin flung off, though. <laughs> now, okay. We didn't get the high score, but we got pretty close, though. We still beat our original one, which I will take. <laughs> now diving into the giant's bath. Why are we diving into the bath? Because we can. It's deep enough for all of us. <laughs> and it looks like there'd be more bread bugs in here, but thankfully, <laughs> it can tell that it's not. Because it doesn't have that kind of like tethered off kind of deal. Nice try, buddy. Nice try little big shrimp. <laughs> yep, here, here, take care of you. Thankfully the RNG for this is actually not that bad. Like they're nice and close but not close enough that we have to really worry about all the Pikmin and us. I don't know if these things would actually be able to drag all of our loot now that I think about it. Never really given them a chance to try. I know that they can still hit us of course so we still ought to be careful about that. Uh, I love shrimp. The like, shrimp and prawns are just so good. Oh, that's right, I forgot about that little guy right there. I think that actually has the key, if I remember correct. I also don't know if they go towards their pigment or towards us, or if they just kind of stay there. Oh, it looks like it's doing its thing. Like, what are you doing, buddy? Are you trying to go after us? Yeah, we have five sprays, so I actually don't mind just doing this. Because then I'll get it off of and out here a whole lot quicker. Of course, as long as we're careful, should I get any of our Pikmin to be hit? It's so awkward though. Come on, cute little guy. I do feel bad for fighting these things though. They're like such cute little like moo moo enemies. Okay, this. I actually really like their like not redesign, but the addition to the family in Pikmin Four. So it looks like. I think that's across from us. Oh, it's like right there. Okay, cool. Ah, uh, that. Nah. You as well bring all our Pikmin with us. We go to the other side anyways. Don't remember if there's a boss in the second area. Oh, hello, Jelly Float. How are you? Thank you for coming towards us. Like, we appreciate that. <laughs> I do also, I feel bad for jelly fighting the Jelly Floats too. Like, they're such beautiful creatures. They're really cute too. Like the lesser jelly floats, they're so small. They also hum. I think if I don't remember how we can hear them singing. I think it's if they're just idolized and nobody's like around them, like all of our Louis aren't around them, there's no pigment around them. You just kind of hear them. You now it's just it's, it's like kind of like details that you just easily miss. Which is such a cute little detail, so. Nice try, little guy. I know you were trying to go after us, but you took the bait. <laughs> Do I feel bad? Kind of, but not really. Also glad that the only hazard that's here, which is very not hazardous because of our uh, pigment type, is just the water. Like, there's no fallen rocks. No uh, red pigment to have to worry about. No electricity. It's nice and easy ease into a kind of deal. But again, there's two floors to here. I don't know Oh, okay, we are going over here. I looked like you were just gonna go forward to the other side. Like <laughs> I still don't remember if there's a boss in the next area or not. Honestly wouldn't be surprised. Also one of the levels that I'm kind of looking forward to <laughs> fight like playing is the bullies done. Oh, I'm sorry, I just punched you guys. <laughs>
I didn't mean to punch you guys. <laughs> I was just moving my glasses and like, whack. <laughs> but okay, let's see. Oh, right. There is a boss. But it's still not too bad, though. Could you guys please not do that? Like, you're gonna give me a heart attack if you keep doing that, buddies. Come on. I just want to step around. I want to get far away enough that we don't have to worry about the Pikmin trying to fight this thing. There we go. No, you are going to stay with Olimar, okay? Olimar is going to be the one that's going to fight this thing. Oh, well, buddy. <laughs> I actually kind of like how you can see the tongue on it. Okay, nope. Back towards us. Come on, buddy. I know you want to eat delicious Louie. It's like licking its lips. I just... It's interesting to me. Nope. <laughs> It'll still be like kind of an awkward fight, though. Too bad we don't have better sprays to uh, come and fight this thing, though. But at least with spicy sprays, though, it makes it a whole lot quicker, though. It regens health? I didn't know it can regenerate health. And there we go. <laughs> really awkward. But hey, that's fine. And I kind of have to wonder, if we just go now, and we don't worry about anything else, and like worry about treasures or anything, if we could actually um, beat the high score at this point. don't think that would be the case, but that would be cool if it were. A bitter spray, you guys. Of course not all of you got bitter sprayed, but hey, that's okay. It still works out for us. It's too bad we don't have a pluck phone either. <laughs> like, the pluck phone would be perfect for challenge mode. But I also see why they wouldn't want to do that, it's because, well, we already have enough here. <laughs> Are you guys going to do that? And we're just going to wait until the other, until the spray wears off. I don't think you can double layer the sprays, as far as I know of, at least. And that was perfect timing. I also really like the fact that aside from purple Pikmin, if you use a spray, all the Pikmin are going to be at the exact same speed. But okay. The slave we beat the high score, it kind of feels like it will be a yes, but it might also be very, very close to being a no. I'd be very surprised if we ended up tying it. And ah, just by a tiny bit. <laughs> but that's okay. It was still really quick and the fact it got that close. Like most of the scores actually is really fun. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, another road done. Still kind of sad that it didn't get recorded in the first place, but that's fine. <laughs> now we have one more left to do. These ones are pretty fun. They I don't really remember breeding ground. What Bully's done though, which you got perfect for. The rest of them are probably going to be able to beat the high score. Depending on if our pigments survive or not, is that all we need? <laughs> but until then, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. If you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up, slap that subscribe button, set the link down in the comments down below. Do what you do, and I may or may not see you in the next video. Hopefully, I will. <laughs> if you made it this far, please give it a yeehaw. But until then, peace.